guys, welcome to my channel. I'm up here at Walmart. After Easter, guys, uh, we're going to check out the prices and shelves, how they are looking. $9.98 for the Folgers there, $12.96 for this one down here, which is the 32.7 ounce. And $8.73 is for the Classic Roast and $9.36 for Maxwell House. If you're looking for the cafe, it's $12.98. So it seems to be sticking right around the same price as the last time when I was here. Let's go check out some other items. Vinegar, $3.34 and $2.28. Well, it looks like vinegar is coming up in price a little bit, and but it is pretty well stocked today. And ketchup is pretty well stocked today as well. I don't know what's going on with my camera. I got it. Uh, check it out but we are at 476 for the Heinz and but you can get great value at $1.98 down there for the smaller container which is um, what do we got on that I turn that one upside down 20 ounce uh, the Hunt's ketchup and over here $1.94 for the great value that's a 32 ounce -er. And the great value is now $5.98, $9.3 cents an ounce for the four pounder. That was definitely going up in price, $6.78 for Jeff. And that is a 40 ounce. So, yeah, peanut butter keeps going up every time I come up here. It keeps going up in price, $3.98 for the uh, two pound. And that's 10 cents an ounce. Check out the tuna fish. The tuna fish is a little low there. <laughs> There's some empty spots. Over here they have some $1.98 for it and $88 over there for the great value. Um, but that right there is completely empty. We do have some up here. Let's go check out the other meat. Keystone beef is still $9.98. These are $5.87 for the 14 and a half uh, ounce. And they have the roast beef up here, 374, pulled pork, 412. So it's looking pretty good. They can get 9.98 for pork pack. And corned beef, 567 and 524 from the Cornell. And we have spam a two pack for 667 for lunch and loaf for 214, which is pretty similar to the spam. And corned beef, 354. For the great value by 67 for that. And over here, let's see if they have any more um, potted meat. It looks like we do have some armor and hammer up there for 82 cents. And we have the Vienna sausages there. And 74 cents for the great value. So. And beans are even going up. Chickpeas, $1.38. $2.52 for the great northern brand. And navy beans, those are my favorite, a dollar thirty-six for one pound. Over here, rice, eighty-eight cents for one pound bag, which is still a great deal. Or if you want to go bigger, go home, eleven seventy-seven and ten ninety-seven for the big bags of rice. And canned beans are always great to grab. Navy beans, seventy-eight cents. Dark kidney beans, seventy-eight cents. But the beans in the cans are always great because they're already cooked. And we still have the great value corn, 50 cents a can. And the green beans, 50 cents a can. Now if you want peas, they're a little bit more. They're 58 cents a can for the peas. And unless you're looking at Del Monte, $1.38 for them. And we are looking pretty good on the pasta sauce, $1.48 for the great value in the jars, and $1.18 for the hunts in the can. But looking pretty good, $1.96 for the ragu, that's 8.2 cents an ounce compared to the great value of 6.2 cents an ounce. But still not too bad, um, you know, grab your extra while you can. And we have uh, the elbow macaroni, two pounds for a dollar eighty-eight, five point nine cents an ounce, or you can get the one pound 
for 98 cents, rotini, and the elbow, and that's great value, of course. And then over here, the Varela, $1.84 for the one pound box. So it's up to you what you get, as long as you get it and put it on your pantry shelf, guys. Egg noodles are looking a little bit thin down there. Uh, they do have some, but uh, not as many as normal. But a dollar forty-three for one pound of the great value egg noodles. And to the sugar, the four pounds of great value sugar is two forty-eight. It has turned down, and we have a pallet there of it. And it's forty-seven for the ten pounds, and then that's what we have there for our great value sugar. But uh, over here in the Domino's is four thirty-three for four pounds of sugar and eight thirty-six for the ten pounds. So these are kind of cool. You can uh, actually reuse those. What I do is I uh, put the cheaper sugar in those because they are good containers with lids. So, but you can buy one and refill it with cheaper sugar if you wanted to. And the great value of flour is two twenty four for five pounds two point eight cents on that, and uh, ten pounds three ninety eight two point five cents an ounce. Not too bad. And three eighty three for the gold medal. Hey, that one is twenty five cents off. That's the one I'd be grabbing if I was going to buy the gold medal. That is, so, but uh, flour seems to not have gone up, which is good. You can still stock up on it. Over here to the oils, we have olive oil, 288 for the Great Buddy brand. And of course, you know, if you use your name brands, they're gonna be more expensive. So, you know, if you use olive oil, uh, get it now, it's gonna keep going up in price, guys. So. And canola oil, 912 for it now. 568 for the Crisco and Lesson is 524. So oil is going up, up, up. 364 for the great value of vegetable oil. And Idahoans are 144 each for the Idahoans. They do have the great value brand for 98 cents each. And they're not too bad. Not as good as the Idahoans, but they will work. And they're easily put on the pantry shelf. We are still seeing some empty areas on the box. Idaho potatoes, uh, three fifty-six on Idaho, and three sixty-two for the GV brand. I wonder if that's more. Ten point seven and twenty-six ounce. Same, but that was cheaper. Okay, so. And a dollar ninety-eight for the seven and a half pounds, or no, thirteen point seventy-five. <laughs> and over here to the pancake syrups, uh, two thirty-six for those. And did you know? Did you know? Read that right there. Can may contain milk, eggs, anchovies, uh, wheat, or wheat and soy. Yep, anchovies. You heard me right. Okay, and over here to the bank fix at dollar ninety-eight. Not looking too bad. Let's go and check out the oatmeal oatmeal three ninety-eight for the great value brand. And five sixty-eight for the Quaker oats. So definitely oatmeal is going up in price. You can get these little bags down here at dollar thirty-eight for the uh, one pound of Tagged oatmeal, so that's a little bit better. And the smaller one here, 414 for it. And let's see how much oatmeal are we getting on that? So that is going to be a pound nine ounces. And 1444 for the large white 60 pound eggs. They've gone up in price, unfortunately. And 440 for the 18. Let's go down here and so we're going to pay for a dozen. It's like two ninety eight dollars for the dozen of our eggs. They keep going up again. Butter is saying it's seven fifty eight for the four stick, two pack of great value, three ninety eight for the one pounder. So that has come down a little bit. 
and if you're looking for your um, spreads, dollar fifty eight for Ontario, dollar sixty three for the blue bottom. So right here, I can get a ten pound roll of burger for twenty forty eight or forty two, and one pound of chuck uh, ground beef for four forty eight. And over here, this is five pounds for looks like eighteen forty-two for those. Here it looks like we're seeing little bad cats on the lunch meat and the sausage hot dogs again. Um, if you need any of these, uh, get them and stick them in the freezer. And the chicken breasts are two ninety-seven a pound. It looks like. And over here, there is a yellow sticker that you can save a little bit on the chicken wings and the egg chicken uh, that's drumsticks $4.94 and $6.72 and the chicken leg quarters so uh, those have come down in price so uh, that's always good to see something come down in price for sure you know look at all those yellow stickers on the pork chops wow bunch of them there so but other than that you're gonna pay let's see looks like 408 a pound for those so it's always good to find the yellow stickers if the meat is looking good and that looks pretty good there and down here to the chuck pot around 667 a pound for that over here chuck tinder roast 646 so still kind of pricey on them here they got some shaved for yellow sticker price, 788 for that. Let's go check out on the rest of the burger. And these is 2434 for the lean ground beef. And that is 72 ounces or four and a half pounds. There we go. And over here, 1368 for the two and a half pounds. The ground beef is so pretty pricey. Okay, here the ground beef round, twelve forty-six, and the Angus is ten sixty-three. But if you want organic grass fed, look at that price right there. Yeah, you're gonna be paying for that grass fed. Potatoes are five forty-seven for ten pounds of russet potatoes, seven fifty-seven. For the jumbo and three ninety seven for five pounds. Oh, yeah, I need to grow potatoes really bad this year. Here's some organic lettuce for two fifty six a head. That's pretty small. See that? Pretty small. And over here, dollar eighty eight looks like. No, that's for the romaine. I don't know how much that is. So. Some of the prices are kind of hard to spot. We do have quite a bit of produce today, so no complaints there. But on the prices, yeah, <laughs> you gotta complain, right? And I know prices have just gone bananas on everyone. But I'll continue to keep you updated on how our shelves are looking and the prices that come up or go down. So if you enjoyed the video, guys, give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you. See you in the next video. Do like God bless.